Hello everybody, thanks for tuning into Ramfish again. This is Jacob, and we are just going to keep on going with Final Fantasy VII Remake. Cloud and Aerith are on their way through the Sector Six slums, going to try to get Cloud home to Sector Seven. but everybody who knows the old game knows where they go next, and that's Wall Market. And we're going to get to see Don Corneo and the Honey Bee Inn, and all that fun stuff so I uh, just want to say thanks for tuning in again guys hit that like button hit that subscribe button if you like what you see and without further ado let us go all right there was a little puzzle that I had a hard time with at the end of the last video but I, I figured it out you just have to put the shipping containers on top of one another here yes ingenious and so, I guess we can switch arms. Bring it on down. Have her climb on. And ever so gently, ever so slowly. Drop her off over there, then she can activate the ladder. I'll have that ladder down for you in a sec. Or lower the ladder, I suppose. And da 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 da. All right, let's get out of these tunnels here. Come around there. And we are golden. Let's get the heck out of here. That went pretty well. Sure did. Uh. <laughs> she really wants a high five. Nope. Oh, don't leave her hanging, Cloud. What are you talking about? Okay. Cloud's just not a high fiver. Just gotta understand that about him. Hold it right there! Oh, here comes the bandits. You wanna pass through our territory? Then you gotta pay the toll. Yeah, here's your toll. I'll give you a toll. No way. Oh, great. Never mind. So it's my turn. <laughs> Oh, we got some electrical thingies coming at us. Hope Cloud wakes up soon. There we go. Oh, now we cast the fire spell. I don't know if we really needed that. Oh, I ran into the electricity. Never used prey. Okay, that just kind of does a basic heal on everybody. That's cool. Oh, we're both shot now. Okay, now Cloud's awake. Ooh, he stole money from me. I don't like that. I hope I get it back. Can he like run away with it? Or we made it. Smell the fresh air. There we go. I got it back. Duck under here. Cloud, up top. All right, fine. Here. Here. Nice. We're a team. You and me. Ah, yeah, that old playground. All right, there it is. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for... Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on. Time 
ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh yeah? Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> really? What's his name? I probably know him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Cloud okay? forgot to take his pills. Because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. That's right. I guess this is goodbye then. Here. Hmm? This won't take long. What's she doing? <sighs> Ready. <sighs> Want to get to Sector 7 in style? This is the passageway for you. Okay, getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. <laughs> Don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies, and it's safer too. This is it then. Ready? Let's go. later but now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo you should head back to seventh heaven meet up with the gang but I'll be fine you've seen how much ass I can kick I have <laughs> yeah <laughs> he's just like I have and she's all dressed up like Queen Amidala oh no you don't you're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. Yeah, you don't Where say. Are going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her.
Come on. I guess we gotta go. Okay. Okay. Come on, right. on. We gotta hurry. Still got Aerith. Let's get a move on. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Hey there. Where are you headed? You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Mm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl here? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what she looks like. <laughs> this guy straight out of the West. Um. Uh, she's a great fighter. Um, she's a great fighter. I'm not sure that helps. Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. I haven't scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, what does that mean? You this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon, if at all. So, where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now, take a walk. <sighs> and there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. All right, gotta go to his mansion. And here we are. It's Wall Market, the famous Wall Market. I was wondering. Oh, okay. I haven't accessed the uh, map yet. Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. Thanks, buddy. All right, what do we have here? Item shop here. It says Chadley's here. Oh man, this place is big. I just gotta walk around. I'll talk to you later, Chadley. Forward here. What's this? Sahara? That's a place on Earth. Oh, don't mind me, just looking for the weapon shop. <laughs> oh man, there's a lot of stuff here. Probably a lot of side quests coming up. What? Oh well, let's not dilly dally around here. Let's go to the go to the mansion. 
Wait, where am I? Excuse me. Warmth, relaxation, the sweet embrace of pretty late. What was that? Never mind, never mind. Let's go, let's go. Yep, up the stairs. I remember he has this big old pagoda up here. I think we might have found our man, and he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Not even knocking, just going right in. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the dumb's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute. Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting oh, permission man. to kill. Denied. If you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're going to need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Oh man, that is awkward. Some people, man, just... It's like this whole market exists for the pleasure of this one weird Don Corneo guy. Ugh. Okay, we gotta go talk to these three folks. Eric, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Oh so my goodness. Up, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. Uh, that was weird. Alright, so... I want to know where the weapon shop... Oh, here, here we go. It's just around the corner. Down here. Did I miss it? Oh, went too far. There we go. What do you got for me, buddy? Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. Nice, a new sword. I'll take it. Bangle, studded bracers, mithra. Okay, well... At least I got the sword. Anything, anything. Ooh, these look... Maybe I'll grab one of these for later. Do come again. Thank you, sir. Now, let's take a look at this. Hmm. Magic attack goes down a little bit. But power goes up. Or attack goes up a lot. I think I'll equip it. It's got it. Yeah, I'll take it.
All right. Okay. Now let's quickly go find these three assistants to this giant pimp or whatever he is. Chocobo Sam was one. You two. Yes, you. Do you have a place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet-looking couple like you. Um... I don't know what to do. Back off, buddy. You're being weird. Sorry, we're in a rush. <laughs> Just give me a holler when you change your mind. Okay. There we go. Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. We got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then, how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> yes, wrong. And you'll leave me in peace. Heads or tails? Heads or tails? Heads. Heads. Tails. You lose. Oh, man. Hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But, if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, and not just the meal. Now, skip daddle. Wait. All right. We're gonna ski daddle. See that coin of yours? Sided coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating. And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. All right, where are we off to next? This little corner down here. All right. Go to the Honeybee. What is it, the Honeybee Inn or the Honeybee Motel or something like that? I can't remember. Ah, maybe it's this thing down here. Yes, I found it. Oh my god, that was lucky. Damn, man. It wasn't supposed to go this down place? like this. Uh, I just so. wanted to see Andrea. Let me handle this. My weak will. You wait out here, okay? It was like, and why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, oh boy. Here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. 
Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years? All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes, well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Ah, well, geez. Didn't have much luck with those people. I know why you're here. To gawk at the honey girls, right? As if you're not here to gawk at the honey boys. Huh. So. Hmm. That one door is locked. Guess we just have to find a way to get that key. Hmm. <laughs> it's like finding a needle in a haystack here. If I go up to the mansion, see what I can see up there again. on getting in and go bother the trio all right all right hmm I'm a little stumped here hmm all right guys I'm back I had to um, I I had to do some figuring out and apparently after you talk to chocobo Sam then you can come here to Madame M's place. So it's you have to just do it in a sequence. Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm -hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension Ooh. is even the simplest task of terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, love of... Say another word and I'll shove this fan rig down your throat. Oh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Jeez, lady. Hmm. Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! Oh. The strong, firm hands of a fighter. Yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. He has a glove on. Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? Oh my goodness. <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back. And wait. Cloud? Well, 
then. It should go without saying that you get what you pay for. All four fingers at once, quick and to the point. <clears throat> Little rough. Hmm? They can stop at any time if it's too much to handle. <clears throat> Oh my goodness. What kind of hand massage was that? Try flexing the muscles. You'll feel the difference. Hmm? Loose and limber. Am I right? Actually, yeah. <laughs> It's all right, I guess. Oh, okay. What are you doing? Flexing. Flexing. Okay, ma okay, so I'm in control of Ares, Gareth here. Um, hmm. I don't know what's gonna Think happen next. Then. Maybe I, I can I slip back here or something? So tell me what you want and we'll take it from there. No? Keep your filthy hands to yourself. You're one of the trio, right? I wanna get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm... Okay. Really? But, you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate for in such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's... It's all right. It's all right, I guess. <laughs> oh, you. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So... What do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. All right. Now you're speaking my language. Uh, fighting tournament. What have that we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. good. My sweet I wouldn't expect I remember, to this time. Just remember, this sequence was always so... That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. So awkward and... But funny. I don't want to give it away what happens. Is this a shop? Oh, this must be the Materia shop. All I got is Materia. Let's see what they got. Uh, I think I have all that. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, thanks for nothing. Alright, let's get to this Coliseum. Alright. This is leading me there.
Ah, yeah, found a chest along the way at least. Oh my goodness, move, move, move. Alright. Oh my god, it's all the way around there. This place is really on my nerves. Here we go. Alright, can you help me get in here, buddy? Nice shirt, by the way. You're here to compete? I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? Team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. All right, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. All right, you got it. Down, down, down we go. So, how deep does this thing go, you think? Uh -oh. How many people are fighting? Uh -oh. Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus, like you should. Hey, lovebirds, over here! He's got the same shirt. In the city that never sleeps, in the paradise of debauchery and sin, the pain and pleasure, where your every desire can be indulged for the right price. Who all must be esteemed connoisseurs of chaos and bloodshed? We bid you the warmest of welcomes. Are you sitting comfortably? Or tonight, the most gruesome spectacle anywhere in Walmart or beyond shall be yours to witness. Here in the Corneo Coliseum! Nice. The is no less than one million gold. It is only one way to get it. Warriors of every shape and size will fight to the death before your very eyes! And tonight, Corneo Time! Oh, now that was a cool show. Wow, this place is really something. Alright, we got anything here we can... Alright, what do you have to say? You two, wait here until it's time. You two. All right. Here until it's time. Check check out this room first. Oh hey, uh, here we go. Here we go. Do I even need a rest? Yes. I'm gonna rest up. Wonder how many fights we're gonna be in. All right, hit the vending machine. We got some a special here on Oh Mega. Good, good, stocked up. Gonna save the progress just in case the worst happens. But yeah. Yeah, I love the the additions they're making to the to the uh, the original game. It's it's uh, it doesn't seem forced at all. It just seems like it's expanded. I'm oh, sorry about your chair. Is it time yet? Uh, it's not your turn yet. Your names will be announced over the speaker. Just wait until then. Oh well, fine then. Oh no, it's Johnny. He's crying. Oh, <laughs> you <again. laughs> oh, man. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know? So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well, 
I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Here we go. Please make your way to the gate. I really want to fight something. I haven't fought anything this whole episode. Used to back out now. I'm assuming it's going to be multiple you fights. You ready? Yep. Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next match, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talk about a bad day. And this is their first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! People in this wall market are perverted. What if wall market's own? A renowned master of beasts. Will his pet make a meal of our two challenges before our very eyes? They've already been given their appetizers. Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable. The demon dogs of hell. The sanguine stalkers. Oh, here come the dogs. Oh my goodness! You brought animals? Oh, first timers, huh? There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We are in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this total contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink. Without further ado, man, what's he feeding those things? Going well against him. He's calling the dogs on me, though. Ooh, a new ability. I'll try that later. I just want to do a triple slash right now. This guy with fire. There you go. Took care of him real quick. I bet you these. Dogs aren't as easy. Try it again with them. All right. This spell seems to be going well for me. All too easy. What a completely unexpected turn of events! And the winners of our match are Cloud and Aaron! Oh, okay, we can go back and rest up. I see. I see. Contenders, please return to your waiting room. Well, that's one win down. Go team! Hmm. What's wrong? The rules don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. Okie dokie then. Looks like we have a few more matches ahead of us. I am gonna head back into the waiting room. And I think I'm going to leave it at that for now, guys. But that that was Wall Market. It's a very strange, silly place. But it's a very interesting part of the game. But yeah, I'm going to save my progress here. And hey, thanks, you guys, for tuning in. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button if you enjoy the show. And we will see you all very soon in the next episode. Bye-bye.